Welcome back, my name's Tara Bradbury to another round of the Art of Business Development series. For our April edition, we're going to be covering increasing your brand awareness. So as a BDM, you can do this as an individual and that obviously will then help the business as well continue to increase their exposure across the marketplace. A lot of things to consider when looking at your brand awareness is thinking about how you can have an impact on the individuals that are in your actual marketplace and area. You're wanting them to have strong word of mouth about what you do and what you have to offer. So coming across in a positive way and providing ridiculous amount of value added information is the best way to be able to grab their attention and get them talking about your real estate business, who you are and what you do as the investment choice when it comes to selecting an agent to manage their most valuable asset. Some tricks that we picked up on in our recent tour where we traveled across Australia and New Zealand under the Real Estate Training Group banner was a lot of people were talking about doing the just listed and just lease flyers. Such a simple process, but it means that you're actually having contact with those that are surrounding the property that you've just listed for rent and that you've just leased as well. So you're spreading the good word. Some other great areas are obviously through social media as well. We're seeing a lot more people now go online with videos, just as we are doing here today, and also with photos and, and different things as well, sharing updates of what's happening in the office, and also tips and investor ideas of what uh, people can do with their properties to ensure they're getting the highest possible return on their most valuable asset. One thing I do encourage if you're wanting to continue to spread the good word about what you do and provide a lot of information to your prospects and your clients is to make sure that the level of professionalism and the level of standard that you're setting your benchmark with your business, with the fees that you charge and the way that your listing presentation comes out, the look and everything that you do as an individual transitions through your marketing as well. So be very cautious if you're going to put different videos online of yourself or you're potentially holding the phone in front of your face or even having it set up in the car where you're talking into a phone and you're actually driving at the same time. To me, that's dangerous and I don't see it as being very professional, but I think it's something to really consider when you're wanting to have a positive impact on those who are in your marketplace. Have some fun, you know, have your property managers drop off clean and tidy room certificates when the kids have done a great job at their routine inspection. Maybe leave some different goodies behind. We've just had Easter, so you could leave maybe some Easter eggs or some little treats behind for the kids to just say thank you, we appreciate the effort that you've gone to. The brand awareness side can spread really well. It's just about doing the smaller things and refining them and doing them consistently within the business so that your clients and your prospects can see you as the investment property choice when it comes to selecting their agent to manage their most valuable asset. Thank you.